Welcome to PPT Gems. So, let's learn how to create animated new year greeting using MS Microsoft PowerPoint presentation. Alright, so let's press enter key and have a new slide. Alright, now we can go to the design and format background and select the gradient print. So, this is the exact gradient print that I want and now I'm going to close it. Now, I'm going to insert an image that I've downloaded from the internet. So here is this image that I've downloaded from the internet. I'm going to increase it slightly a little bit. All right. Now in the next step, what am I going to do? I am going to insert the text box. So here is my text box. All right. And I am going to write here. Okay. Right. Now I'm going to change the size of text box. All right. And I'm going to select the text and this style okay and i'm going to increase the size Perfect. now in the next step what am i going to do i'm going to select this text box again and i'm going to press the control to make the text box and i'm going to move it aside now i'm going to select this image after that i'm going to select this text box okay now we'll go to the shape format, we'll go to the first shape and we'll select in this. Alright, so basically I have added that image inside our text. Now in the next step, I'm going to bring the another copy of the text exactly on top of it. Yeah. Okay, fine. Now in the next step, I'm going to format it. Yeah. So format text effects. And I'm going to fill it with white color. Alright? Okay, yeah, it's a mistake. Let's select the pink text. And the color is set to be white. Okay, and transparency. I think 45 bits. Okay. So transparency of text options. Text fill and let's reduce the transparency to copy person. Alright, now in the next step, we'll go to the 3D format and in the 3D format, the lighting I'm going to select the screen lighting. Okay, I'm going to do and write fine. Now in the next step, if you want, you can give some uh, round. Or some other kind of line. Right. Perfect. Okay. Now, in the next step, I'm going to add some icicles. But before that, there is another important thing. So, we have to get text effect. We have to get some reflection. And the reflection will be. Okay. Now, I'm going to add some uh, icicles for that we could insert. We go to shapes. And in shapes, we go to slip. Okay, now look here carefully how I am doing. From here, I'll go up, I'll go here, slant, and then randomly, I'm going to make the next right. Okay, now let's fill this option. Let's shape outline to be white. Right. I'm going to format the shape. So, I will go to the effects option, okay, and in the effects option, I will select the material to be translucent and lighting to be special. Alright, so like this, I am going to add icicles to all my letters. So basically now, I have added this snow effect in on each of my letters okay now let's give some animation so we'll select these icicles one by one we'll go to the animation we'll select fly in and from top okay and this the first one should start with previous now the second one same from top and the second one should start after previous all right similarly let's Go for this W. So fly in from top.
So now I have added animation to each to each icicles. Now let's have a preview. Okay, like this. They are going to appear. Now I want to add another text. So for that I'm going to use this text here. Okay, and here I'm going to write. Now select the text and I'm going to select okay and bold and increase the size a little bit perfect and now I'm going to change it a little bit and then to it. Alright now basically what I want I want this text to appear as soon as my animation to this icicles finish. Alright, so for that I'll go to the animation effect and I'll go to the shape option. Okay, and here I am going to select start with previous. Okay, now in the next step, I'm going to add the snowman. So here basically I have added the snowman and I have divided this snowman into three parts like this. Okay, now I'm going to rearrange them back like this. The round bottom, this part here, and the face, and the top. All right, like this. Okay, now in the next step, I want this part to appear first. This is the same animation, flyer, but from the top, okay, and start with previous. Okay, but now I want to delay it by 1.75 seconds. Next, fly in from top. Okay, but when after previous. Now, third part, fly in from top, add news after previous. So, let's have a preview of the same slide. Thank you.